New York's weather has been so crazy this year. It was winter until like June. And now in October, like we're finally getting this like kind of fall kind of weather right now. Um, and then occasionally it's like still in the 80s. So it's really weird. I picked out some what I'm gonna call essentials. These are pieces that I think are really easy to make outfits around and like just pieces that you can throw on really quickly that I think look super easy, really chic, and yeah, are just like pieces that I am gonna be gravitating towards. I know this fall and winter. Most of these pieces are secondhand, but I think a lot of them are pieces that are very frequented in secondhand stores. So I think they'll be easy for you guys to find as well, especially on Depop. I think you could easily find some items very similar to these if you're interested. But yeah, with that being said, let's just get right in. So one of the first pieces that has stood through the test of time for maybe like the past three winters, like fall and winter is, is that I just like love quilted jackets. I think they're really easy. I think they look really cool. And I just feel like I buy a new one every season and then like get rid of the older ones, but they all look so similar. I just found this new one on Depop. This baby was only $15, which I think is kind of crazy because it's really nice and it's Levi's. So yeah, this was a steal. Again, one that I will be definitely bringing back from last year is just this military liner. I think I'll probably get another one that's slightly more oversized. You can find these online for like $10. So I definitely recommend, you can just kind of like search military liner and you can find them really easily. I think they're really cool. They make like the perfect lightweight jacket. Next, I always like to just throw in a pair of like fun pants and I think I think like a red silk like these is gonna be really nice. I've had these since last year, I think, but I uh, think I'm gonna be getting a lot more wear out of them. I think the silk will look really nice with like turtleneck sweaters. They just kind of like bring like a little more like allure to an outfit and wearing them with like some lady shoes and like hair up in a bun I think would be really nice, but like laid back, but still like kind of cool if you catch my drift. <laughs> I actually thrifted these pants just a few weekends ago and I'm seriously so obsessed with them. They are DKNY, which right now not super fan of the brand because Donna Karen just like said some really ignorant statements and so not really supporting her but I do like these pants and they're second hand so it's not like she's getting any proceeds from me anyways. But they are really nice pants, I'll say. They are just kind of this wide leg trouser and they're wool, which is really nice because I think they'll keep me nice and warm this winter and fall. These are just a super easy staple. They go with anything, t-shirts, just like black boots. Super easy to throw on. And yeah, I'm excited to wear these. And they're a little big, so I think I'll just belt the top but definitely not a problem. And these are so easy to thrift pants like these. The amount of, I have so many pairs of pants. I'll be adding a few to my Depop just because I found a few pairs that fit me better, like these pair. Um, so I'll get rid of the older ones that don't fit me perfectly in hopes that they fit one of you perfectly or someone else. Berets have been kind of hot for a while. I think they really like peaked like last winter and this winter I think they'll be like everywhere. That's not really gonna deter me from wearing them per se. I really like this one because it's so pretty. It's such a beautiful bright blue color. One of my good friends, Tristan, brought this back from Paris for me, so it's really special to me. But yeah, I really like this beautiful blue one, but berets, like, hate to say it, but they just make an outfit, like, kind of come together. I think they're really nice, super simple, but really chic as well. I picked this up on a whim the other day, but I really like it, so I thought I'd just add it in this video. I got it at like a secondhand kind of furniture store, but they have clothing as well. And it's just this vintage fanny pack. I kind of adjust it and I sling it over my back instead of wearing it around my waist. This has been coming in handy just for like a super easy bag. When you when you really don't feel like carrying a bag, it like fits all your essentials. You can sling it over sweaters or anything. It looks kind of cool too, in my opinion, but it definitely is like utility for me. So I'm sure I'll be using this a bunch. Another piece I've been super into is short sleeve sweaters. So this one I've had for a while. I actually just dug this out of my mom's closet a really long time ago. 
and yeah they're just like a perfect transition piece from summer to fall kind of a sweater kind of a t-shirt it's like you don't really know but they go with everything again this will be perfect like tucked into some like wide leg trousers or just like jeans anything there's just a lot you can do with it this next piece kind of crazy for me i have not received like clothing in the mail for such a long time but this company reached out to me grana it's spelled G-R-A-N-A, -A. I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, but I really like them. I stand behind like their company ethics. So I was like, yes, you can send over a couple of pieces because they're all about investing in like quality, stable pieces. And they have a lot of transparency within their company and how things are made. So I really like stand behind them. I had to get this sweater because it's so cool. It looks really vintage and I really wanted to pick out something that is like staple like I'll be able to wear this for winters and fall to come and this is like a classic stripe I think it's really cool but yeah I would just say like a timeless stripe sweater you can't really go wrong it's perfect for the holidays it's perfect for every day it just like looks cool keeps you warm and yeah this one's lightweight and like super nice quality too so I'll link that below if you want to check it out <laughs> If you guys have seen any of my thrift hauls, you know that I am always grabbing blazers. This one is really perfect because it kind of acts as like an overcoat as well. Um, so it's just like an oversized blazer. So any kind of blazer will do. I think my favorite way to mix these is maybe with like a skirt and tights underneath or you could just do with like baggy jeans to kind of play down like the business look. I always kind of try to contrast it with something a little more casual so it's not like super businessy unless you want to go that vibe that's totally okay too i think like wearing it as a pantsuit will be cool as well i'll probably do that one night with like just like a little tube top under it i think would look really cool for like going out um but yeah super easy to find blazers as well very cheap and inexpensive in thrift stores another piece this is i'll go over quickly because it is definitely one of my like year essentials and that's baggy blue jeans. I like buy jeans, I think these are a size like 32 waist or 34, so much bigger than my waist, but they, I just bunch them and then they just hang so nicely. They're comfy. Like I wear these jeans more than I wear anything else. Everything looks good with them. I can't get enough. I just like think baggy jeans are the way of my life. It, I can't imagine a day that I stop wearing them because they're so comfy. <laughs> And for my last two essentials, I have been loving like little lady shoes, I call them, but just like small little pumps that I've been wearing them with socks a lot, like white socks over underneath pants, I think looks so cool. It's really effortless and it makes them way comfier as well. So if you have any problems with them rubbing your feet, just throw on a pair of socks underneath and you're good to go. But yeah, they just like add a little elevation to a look, especially if you're feeling like slumpy with like baggy jeans and like a sweater and you add these it just like kind of brings together the whole look for my last essential is big gold hoops these are like everywhere right now but i'm gonna go ahead and stay with it i really like big hoops especially with like a bigger chunkier knit and like your hair pulled back i think that's like the quintessential like fall look for me it's super easy and yeah, you can find like big hoops on Depop, literally anywhere. They're really easy to find and they just like, if you're feeling frumpy again, just like adding a nicer accessory just like makes it look like you've done everything on purpose, um, even when it's just like cold and shitty out. Those are all of my fall essentials. Let me know down below what your favorite pieces are, what you guys wear like relentlessly down below and I'll see you guys so soon with another video.